Hi, my name's Elliot Colburn and I'm the MP for Carshall and Wallington. And one of the things I love about this job the most is getting to represent the area that I call home. I was born at St Helier Hospital, I went to school at Car Shorten Boys and everything I do is just that little bit more special to me because I know it's about the same streets and the same services that I've used on a regular basis. And that's why I'm so excited to announce I am launching my own apprenticeship programme. I am going to be taking on a school leaver, someone who's about to come to the end of their school career at the end of the school year, to come and work in my office in a paid position for just over a year and they will be provided with on-the-job training but also acquire a qualification that is being provided by Car Shorten College and you'll get to experience everything that an MP's office has to do. That includes helping constituents, organising and attending meetings, doing research, looking up policy and so much more. I'm so excited for you to apply and to find out more so please look out for the details and get involved. Hi there my name's Tommy I'm Elliot's office manager. I've worked for Elliot for over a year now and I know just how much of a strong voice he is for Carshalton and Wallington the community he grew up in and now represents. Before joining Elliot's office I'd worked in Parliament since 2014 including for three cabinet ministers and I know just how much fun and how much experience you can get by working for an MP. It is an opportunity I would absolutely recommend you put yourself forward for. The apprenticeship programme will run for 15 months from July this year through to September next year. Applications open mid-March and will close at the end of April. You'll have to send in a CV, a cover letter and do a short written exercise and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. It is an amazing opportunity and I really hope that you'll consider putting yourself forward for it. Look forward to hearing from you. Hi there, my name's Jonathan and when I was doing my A-levels I uh, wasn't too sure what I wanted to do and I wasn't too sure if I wanted to go to university. And after I saw that my local MP was offering a apprenticeship, I thought it would be a fantastic chance to go and earn some cash and also learn some uh, skills. And while I was there, it was the most fantastic year and I managed to learn so many new things and it really started a passion in pol politics. And after I had uh, done that and I'd uh, saved some cash, I uh, then decided to go to, un to university. And after I graduated, uh, it was with the skills I had learned with the apprenticeship that uh, I managed to be able to find a job straight away after, after I left wor working for an M MP again. And uh, so really it was the exact link between me do doing the appre apprenticeship and me being able to leave un university and uh, with the skills to uh, go and find a job. And that's why I would definitely recommend to anyone who's not too sure about what they want to do to just go and take a year, do, do an apprenticeship and, and really learn some new skills. Hi. My name's Catherine Gray and I'm Elliot's Senior Parliamentary Assistant, responsible for overseeing the casework for his office. We're a small team of five working between the constituency office and Parliament and we usually act as the first point of contact between Elliot and constituents that come to him for his help and support. Our apprentice will split their time between the constituency office and Parliament as well as having some time to study and will be able to gain experience in casework and parliamentary activity. No two days are the same. We work hard to help constituents with a diverse and varied range of issues, which can be quite tough sometimes, but we also do try to have fun and we find the positive outcomes that we help to achieve for people very rewarding. To join Elliot's team as an apprentice, you don't have to be a conservative, but a can-do and positive attitude alongside with a willingness to learn is an absolute must. We look forward to welcoming you. So I really want to encourage you to apply for this apprenticeship. Applications will open on the 15th of March and will close at the end of April. We'll be appointing our apprentice at the beginning of May and you'll get started with us in July. Now, whatever you want to go and do after this apprenticeship is over, if you want to go into university or go straight into the world of work, there are so many things that you'll be able to pick up throughout the course of your apprenticeship with us that I hope you'll be able to go on and use in whatever you want to do. It's going to be so much fun. There's going to be so much to do and so much to learn. And I really, really hope to hear from you and get your application. So get involved and I look forward to seeing you.